Hello YouTube, this is Keith Kevin Ken. How you doing? How you doing? Hope you're doing well. I really do. Hope you and yours is doing just great. Time again for another knife of the day. I'm I'm finishing up. I notice I have a couple other new Spydercos that I never showed you guys. Um, kind of different than what we're used to, but you'll see them. I figured I might as well go ahead and show you those too. But this one is the last of that new package that I got just a couple of days ago. The knife of the day is the Spydaco Little Native with the spider edge, the serrated edge, and the compression lock. So a couple of weeks ago, I brought to you and everyone on YouTube talked about the Little Native. The Little Native is basically a small size big native a very little native very little we're talking about a native with a 2.5 inch blade the regular native is a three inch blade so that was the native and it was released with the compression lock spydaco's own compression lock the lock that's on the Paramilitary 2, the Para 3, the Sage 5, <laughs> you know, this lock. Just a wonderful lock. Strong, look at that, smooth as silk. Remember, this just came out of a package a couple of days ago. Smooth as silk. And this is a really small knife. The one thing about the knife is, now I don't have big hands, but I've got fat, chubby hands. And you get four fingers on this when you use that 50-50 choil, and it's really nice. Full flat grind. It's a heavy-duty little knife that's just shy of the 2.5-inch blade. It's important that it's shy of the 2.5-inch blade. We talked about the 3-inch constraints that some places have. Well, there are some places that have a 2.5 inch constraint like Ohio and others. And so this is great market for them. I also like small knives. I'm in an office all the time. So you can actually, believe it or not, with this big knife, this little knife, big knife, little native, you can just drop it into a pocket. It's that small. 2.5 inch blade, I mean the, to the total size of this is just six inches just six inches and it's just 2.4 ounces and you have s30v steel a very good steel s30v steel on it now this variation has the spider edge the serrated edge on this and again i think besides spiderco nuts like me who love small knives especially with this compression lock. It is definitely the smallest knife from Spydaco with the compression lock. I think that electricians and other folks in those places where big knives are shunned could really use this, but also I like a serrated edge. I know a lot of people don't. I like serrated edge. I like combo edges. It's just really flexible cutting cord, cutting, I mean, cutting boxes too. This is very strong. Just a real nice knife. A new variation from Spydaco. Now remember, Spydaco started, and I think it was smart, they started the little native with the compression lock. Even though the regular native always has a back lock, right? They started the variation with the compression lock. The back lock little natives are coming. It's kind of funny. I'm not sure why they're bringing a back lock native. I guess it brings up the point. I guess some people like a back lock better. I'm okay with a back lock. Spydaco has really been improving on them over the years. But man, the compression lock to me makes a lot of sense. Maybe because they wanted to say that this was a little native, they needed to bring out the backlog. 
I think once you start bringing out a backlog, this starts looking like some of the smaller backlock knives um, that Spyderco already has. But we'll have to see, like the Chicago. But we'll see. I'm, I'm interested in seeing it. I really like the little native. I didn't think I'd like it as much as I do. So that's the S30 V steel from Crucible. 2.4 ounces. I mean, it's very light. Black G10. See-through construction with that compression lock. Full stainless steel liners embedded into the handle. It is definitely skeletonized, embedded into the scales. Um, the clip is the wire clip, which I really love. It's right hand or left hand tip up only. Because of the lock and everything, they don't have tip down. But just a real nice knife. I, I enjoy the pair. They're so small. Just really a nice knife. Made in the USA. Yeah, in Colorado, which I like too. I'll put money that a whole lot of variations off of the little native is coming our way. A whole lot of variations. I'd love to see this with upgraded steel and especially with carbon fiber. Oh, I'd love it. When we talk about what the size is, sometimes when you put things on the screen, you kind of forget the size. Well, that's a dragonfly. <laughs> so it's just a little bit bigger than a dragonfly. And I keep saying, and it's named the little native. Well, that's the native. And you can see it's really small. But a real handy knife. If you're overseas and you have that blade issue size, this would be good as well. But I just like it. I like the little native, and I love the compression lock. Frankly, if they just stopped with the compression lock, I'd be happy, and I would be waiting for the variations in the sprint runs. I'd love to have that in all kinds of different types of blades and, and scales. But they are going to come out with the back lock, and as Spyderco does, they'll look at what the sales look like, and then, trust me, one of those will be discontinued <laughs> in the next year or so. There you have it. That's the knife of the day. It's the Spyderco Little Native, L-I-L, apostrophe, Little Native. Just a nice little pocket size, great for your second knife. If you're enjoying these daily knives of the day as we go through my collection, one knife at a time, one day at a time. Don't forget to thumb it up. Subscribe. Uh, we're <laughs> only, man, not even 30% of you watch this subscribe. So please take a second and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell so you don't miss any of the videos that are coming up because I will be doing other videos besides just the knife of the day. And of course, as the new Spydecos come out in 2018, you'll be seeing them, if not first, very early on this channel. Thanks a lot for your time. I know it's precious. Take good care of yourselves and your family. Have a perfect day. Keep those pockets full. Goodbye.